Hey everyone, welcome back to John's Watch. Today we take a look at a new game called Flotsam. This game was released on Steam on September 26, 2019. The trigger price is $28.99 Canadian. That's probably around $24.25 US or regional equivalent. And it's developed by Pajama Llama Games and published by Congregate. So Flotsam is the floating garbage town survival game. <laughs> Scavenge what precious garbage you can from the ocean surface and grow your city while doing your best to survive in this colorful post-apocalyptic world. So I've seen a little bit of gameplay of it. It's basically like a city builder entirely on the ocean. It's a little bit like like raft meets city skylines, I guess. Anyway, let's check this out. Oh, yes, what was that? <laughs> Look at that custom cursor. Ah, well that's it then. Garbage floods wiped away our village. Perhaps we should stop sticking on these useless rocks and go explore. Who needs land? These endless blue waves, that's all we need. The flooded world is our oyster. Let's polish this plastic into beautiful pearls. If only we weren't out of fuel. What should we call our new town? Snorkel Cove. I love it. Ah, there's Snorkel Cove. Okay, so we've got a little quest here to start. Sailboat on the rocks. Um, some drifters tried making a town on that island. Bad idea. Perhaps we can make use of its mast. Okay. So this is presumably what we'll get if we can get to it. And it looks like it's over here. So we have to get over there. So do we like select this? And I think that might be how we have to like get people to go pick it up. There we go. So we set that like there. Where's 84? Perfect. Okay, and it costs a little bit to enlarge it. There we go. So our people are going. How many people do we have? It's actually just hidden behind my recording. <laughs> marker, I think it's three. <laughs> it's three or eight. Okay, so we can now start building things. So this should, they should be just kind of getting this stuff. Yeah, that's going up. Yeah, they're, they're working on it. We need more people, really. Okay, so these are all the things we can build. And we'll mostly, mostly be doing walkways, I think. I assume we can probably, yeah, we can speed up up here. There we go, so we can now do a walkway if we wanted. Oh, can we, we can actually just get... How many do we have? It, it might be eight up there. We can get five people on here though, so that should get stuff going a lot faster. Hello. Oh, hello. Okay, so if we want to build, we can only build in here right now. And we can, we can attach stuff right to our little home. Or we can build a little walkway. Maybe let's just like start doing a walkway here. Okay, so that's how much we have. We can do... We could do a fair bit, we could do that much. Let's do that. I wanna watch them build. Are you gonna do it? They're not doing it, they're just gathering stuff here. Oh no, they're, they're building. Let's speed it up a little bit. Because it, it is actually taking them quite a while. We need some wood, I think. Oh no, what's wrong with them? They're thirsty, I think. So we've still got enough water right now. Presumably we'll be able to like build something here. Yeah, we do need wood. So let's get another one of these up here. What's the most? I saw 20, I think. 21. Where are you, Where are you 21? I'll just take 20. It's impossible to get the 21. Okay. And that can also have five people go into it. Excellent. So you, you can enlarge it a little bit for free, it looks like. But we'll keep this one focused on wood for now. Because we do need some wood. And presumably we're going to actually need to dry our wood. So we'll do a little drying rack here, which we can attach just wherever. Put that there. And I guess we're going to run out of storage very soon. I can't see if it says, like, what our max is, but... I'm gonna go ahead and build the storage yard just across there. Lovely. So how's this one doing? Okay, so I think that's all it's got left to pick up. Ah, uh, wet wood. Okay, so yeah, we'll, we'll get it all dried off. And this... There's 19. Oh no, it's still got 20 left to go. I think they're finishing this one first. Yep, so that we, we've picked up the, the wet wood, so... There's only two bits of plastic left to get here. Okay, so on the drying rack, we have to choose what it needs. So we would just want to do dry wood. That's now going. Great. 
Okay, so here's our inventory. So we are actually getting pretty close to being full. And this one did not actually give us very much. It only gave us like 20. So let's get another one of those. Right, how much? There are only eight. So let's get two more. There we go. Then when those are done, we'll, we'll see how much they give. Okay, look, yeah, it looks like each one gives 20. And it looks like the marker just kind of deleted itself when it was done. Okay, we're, we're doing good on storage now. Very good. What do we need here? We just need dry wood. So how's how's the wood doing? Oh, there we go. It's, it's just finishing. So it actually takes a while, but we've now got three dry wood. I think we needed eight here. Okay, we need more markers down, I guess. Need lots more wood. Let's just stick it in the middle and like enlarge it a bit. There we go. We've got five people on that again. We get some wood over here. Yeah, there's a fair bit of wood there. And enlarge that one as well. Perfect. We're gonna have to deal with some food soon. Oh, okay, we do only have three people. That's good. It looks like an eight, okay? It's covered by an icon. Okay, this wood does take forever to dry. Like, watch, watch the bar fill up. <laughs> there you go. There we go. This is on three times speed as well. Oh god, how full are we getting? Oh god, we need more storage. Uh-oh. Ooh, we can do a small house. Let's do it. Bam. I guess let's start building over here to the limits. How do we increase the limits? Okay, I'm not quite sure how we're going to get people to get more food right now, but it's not a big deal. We've still got 34. So we're okay. How is this drying? Alright, we spent it on our home. Where's the home? Small house. God, only one person can live there. Jeez. We pretty much just need wood to dry now. Okay, we're about to get our ninth bit of wet, uh, dry wood. Yes. So we can do the water thingy. Hooray. I'm just I'm just putting everything along here right now. This will be Main Street when it's a, an actual bustling city. <laughs> Which isn't right now. Oh my god, look at that thing. Absolute unit. He seems chill though, which is good. Okay, our water distiller is done. Oh no, it needs fuel. Oh, because I probably have to make the woodworking shed first, okay. So let's just stick that next to it. And then they'll probably be able to make firewood and I think they can make rope and stuff. Okay, so yeah, they can make rope here, they can make some firewood. Which needs dry wood. And dry wood there as well. So let's queue up two firewoods and... I don't know, one, yeah, two firewoods, fine. And then as soon as we have our firewood made, this should start working. Oh, we're actually really close to being able to get a boat and a fishing boat. So need this, we just, or to do this, we just need a rope. So let's queue up a rope. Okay, I think this is, has it been doing anything? Yes, it's done a water. <laughs> okay. Uh, is our rope done? Yes, our rope's done. So now we can do a mooring point. Let's do a little mooring point on the end. And then what are we going to need for this? Just this to be built. Okay, we use this to scavenge the island, so we can almost get over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so let's do a salvage boat. Okay, so there's only one, like, parking space here, unfortunately. <laughs> Uh, I guess let's queue up... What does this need? Just... Two more firewoods, just to get a bit more water, because we're pretty low. And it looks like, um, just kind of stuff starts spawning in, the, in like, the water behind you, if you've already looked there. So I, I don't really need... Oh, I guess I do need more plastic. Let's, oh, we can't quite get this yet. Let's get everything we can. Oh, is our boat done? Do you have to make someone the captain? Ah. Who knows? Okay, so we can just click salvage now. There we go, somebody's going over. Okay, so we've got one boat and one available mooring point. He's on here. Excellent. 
I guess he's got everything. He's immediately leaving. I oh, know he's taken some things back. Good, good on him. Oh no, we need. To, yeah, we did it. Now oh, we need to build more houses, actually. Okay, so we can now do like a um, a salvage boy for a boat. Not like. I don't think we can actually place it anywhere in here. We've, we've done everything we can. I don't know how to get out of there. Or maybe this is just where we can build. I could probably just, like, remove that. And place this over here. There we go. Oh, excellent. We can get all this stuff. So we can just build inside our circle right now. Anyway, that was a look at Flotsam. I think this is very promising so far. It's early access right now. There's also like research tiers where you can presumably unlock more things, like a bigger storage yard, because I think we've just got a small one right now. Plastic recycler, other things that we didn't get very close to at all. And some of the screenshots have like pretty big cities. So I assume we'll be able to build like outside of our, like this thing at some point. Anyway, that was Flotsam. Thank you guys very much for watching. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.